I'm Charles Bankhead of MedPage Today, reporting from the San Antonio Breast Cancer Symposium. Vaginal estrogen preparations are absorbed systemically, posing an uncertain risk to postmenopausal breast cancer patients, according to results of a small clinical study reported here. Dr. Shannon Wills of William Beaumont Hospital in Royal Oak, Michigan, explains how the observation was made. We have a very large population of breast cancer patients, and when breast cancer patients have gone through their chemotherapy, um, and then you put them on an aromatase inhibitor or tamoxifen if they're estrogen receptor positive, there are side effects that come from those particular drugs. And so our interest was in whether or not these vaginal estrogens are absorbed because the literature for postmenopausal women only states that um, there is no absorption after a certain period of time. But the concern, of course, being that we're dealing with breast cancer patients. And so any estrogens being used in breast cancer patients is always of a concern. And after our patients have failed everything else, every other method that is a non-estrogen containing method, sometimes this is all we have left to treat the atrophic vaginitis in the patients. And so our interest in doing this was to see whether or not they were absorbing the estrogens. Absorption patterns differed between estrogen tablets and the vaginal ring, but patients' serum estradiol levels increased with both formulations. In the Vagifem tablet patients, the estradiol levels seem to spike and then come back down to baseline at some point in time. For the S-ring patients, it was a continuous absorption from the time that the ring was inserted until the replacement of the next ring 90 days later. So. Um, we know that there is absorption in both the tablet and the ring. We do not know if there's any clinical significance. We do not know if that increases their chances for breast cancer um, regeneration of the tumor. We just know that there is absorption. Of the two, you can't say one's safer than the other, but from the way it looks, I would prefer the tablet over the ring. From the San Antonio Breast Cancer Symposium, I'm Charles Bankhead, MedPage Today.